Once upon a time, there was a poor widow who lived with her only son named Jack. And a large cow named Milky White. <laughs> All they had to live on was the milk that the cow gave every morning, which they carried to the market and sold. One day, the cow dried up. <laughs> Jack was sent to the market to sell the beloved Milky White. to buy his cow for some beans. What kind of beans are these? asked Jack suspiciously. These are magic beans, replied the old man. Plant them overnight, and by morning, they'll grow right up to the sky. Well, why not, said Jack. That he handed over the cow and pocketed the beans. When Jack got home, his mother finally found out what he had gotten in return for Milky White. She was so angry, she snatched the beans out of his hand and tossed them out of the window. Then she sent Jack to bed without any supper. and climbed and climbed until at last he reached the sky. When he got there, he found a long road and he followed that to an enormous castle. On its doorstep was a great big woman. Morning, ma'am. Could you be so kind as to give me some breakfast? If it's breakfast you want, it's breakfast you'll be if you don't get out of here. My man's an ogre, said the woman. something to eat. I've had nothing since yesterday morning. So she took Jack into the kitchen and gave him some food. But Jack hadn't half finished eating when...
Then Jack crept out of the oven on tiptoe. And as he was passing the ogre, he took one of the bags of gold under his arm. And off he pouters until he came to the beanstalk. Then he threw down the bag of gold. Which, of course, fell into his mother's garden. Then he climbed down and climbed down and climbed down. Till at last he got home. Well, mother, wasn't I right about the beans? They really are magical, you see. stalk again and return to the ogre's castle. And sure enough, he saw the great big tall woman standing on the doorstep. Morning, Mum. Could you be so kind as to give me something to eat? Go away, my boy. But aren't you the youngster who came here before? She asked. Do you know that very day my man missed one of his bags of gold? That's strange, said Jack. I dare say I could tell you something about that, but I'm so hungry I can't speak till I've had something to eat. Well, the big tall woman was so curious, she took Jack in and gave him something to eat. Scarcely had he begun munching his food when...
This time, when he got near the house, he waited outside until he saw the ogre's wife come out with a pail to get some water. Then he crept inside and hid behind a broom. He hadn't been there long when he heard... Selling the golden eggs. 
Jack and his mother became very rich. And he married a great princess. 